And ladies and gentlemen, the opponent from the blue corner, all the way from Azerbaijan, Edidam Danishov. for the 2022 Gamma World MMA Championships. Now the next fight is a final of 61.2 kilos in MMA. Nika Kudushauri versus Tiran Darisha, Georgia versus Azerbaijan, another battle of two neighbors, this time Caucasian neighbors. And another very crowded division, division 18 participants in this weight class, including the athletes from Poland, US, Australia, India, Azerbaijan, Madagascar, and the other countries. But these two young men, they managed to advance to the finals. So let's see who is the more deserving athletes of, of them too. Both competitors had a very hard road to the final. Yeah, they both they had to have three very difficult fights on the way to the finals. So let's see who, who saved more, more power and health for, for this very, very last fight tonight for them. Yeah, so both countries has they they already have one one world champion champion each so for them it's a good good opportunity to to have an advantage in this this com competition of two neighbors Oh, now we see it, it might be a tight triangle, not yet, but I think, yeah, Azerbaijan, uh, Azerb uh, fighter is going to work on this. Yeah, Darashov uh, showed progressing through the rounds yesterday that he has very dangerous submissions from his back. Yeah, and, and you can see it, he was very fast with the uh, closing the triangle, and now you can see it's, it's tight, it's tighter than it used to be, so now I think the, the Georgian guy, he doesn't... Have, he doesn't experience like too much troubles, but he, he soon he might start to experience them. Well, it's very tight in there, so it's going to be difficult for, for the Georgian athlete to escape. But he is able to strike. Yeah, we see that Darishev is not in a hurry. He's experienced. He's working simultaneously on the triangle and the arm bar. He's trapped in there in the, near to the cage, but he, he's keeping his composure. He's working. And his submission attempt. And Georgian Atlet is he's trying desperately to get out of this submission hole. Yeah, that is not a nice place to be. Yeah, and especially now in the first round. Oh, when, and he, and oh. switches to the armbar here. Yeah, he he could straighten it out. Let's see if he gets the tap. Now it's an armbar. 
Gudushaure is trying to get out of the armbar. He's defending the right way. He, he is. It's, yeah, it's still dangerous, but it's not as dangerous as it used to be in the first second. So now he's moving in the right direction. So there is a quite big chance that he's going to get out of it. Yeah, and that's exactly what he's doing. And he's trying for the vertical triangle, I guess. That's or at, le at least he's in a good position for that, but I don't know if he's really going to go for it. It seems like he's... Oh. Interesting position there. So now uh, Efteram moved to the side control and that's how this this round was ended. Very, very intense, very entertaining round. Yeah, very high level grappling. Uh, the submission attempts from the back, Darishov really made his opponent use a lot of strength to try and escape the oh, yeah. submission holds. So expect the Georgian competitor to be slightly more tired. I think so. I think so. He's, he spent a lot well. of energy like trying to get out of the yeah. uh, of this submission hole. But it was nice to see that Gudushauri he didn't lose his cool. He was all the time constantly trying to get yes. out like and do, doing it right. Mm -hmm. And he eventually get out of got out of the, the choke hold. Interesting to see how uh, the Georgian strategy might change now that he knows how dangerous Darishov is fighting off his back. Oh yeah, and uh, now Darishov he he won he, he won the first round on the scorecards of the two judges. It, it was very even round. It was close, yes. Yeah, so it was it was a split. Yeah, one one judge gave it to the Georgian fighter, two others gave it to the Azerbaijan fighter. Oh, oh, big shot! That was a big shot. Big shot. Darishov just walked right through that, and he's attacking. Yeah, and he is going in, for the he, grappling here. Yeah, he immediately attacking and trying to recover, and also like simultaneously to take his opponent down. Got called. But that the, really was a big shot. That, yeah, that that was a shot that could easily end like any fight in this weight class. Yes. But the sure the sheer will to to want to continue, like you know, it, it, it really is amazing. And going to his instincts and straight to the grappling. Yeah. So Darishov, in, in his previous fight, he showed, like he demonstrated his toughness and willing to to, to become the champion. And to, tonight we we see it again. And now he's he's trying really hard to to take his opponent down. And I think now he. He has recovered after this big shot, so like now, now he he can normally work on the takedown. Yeah, so that was the break that Azerbaijan fighter needed a lot, you know, after after this shot. So now, now he's he's recovered, even though maybe not not fully recovered. And maybe, maybe Georgian fighter, he found the key to his opponent. Maybe he's trying to replicate that success. Oh, and we see very fast one leg, one leg takedown. Really fast level change on a single leg there. Yeah, Darishov is, is very fast in changing levels and we, we, we've seen it. We've seen it like two previous days. He's doing it again and he's, he's trying to to work on the guillotine. And again, now it's it's dangerous, but not very, very dangerous. But he's he's. It's difficult he's, to finish from yeah, that, that position with the one arm in. He's going to need to create some space and 
I'm sure we're going to see Dereshoff throw up some submissions here from the back. There he is climbing up with the high guard here. Shoulder walking. Very, very close round that was. Again, yeah. It's a very, very tough job for, for, for the judges now. Dereshoff constantly threatening with the submissions, but you, you can't deny the Georgian competitors. Big right oh, hand. Oh, yeah, there. especially wow. Look that at was that. Beautiful, huh? But Dereshoff managed to weather that. And it's a very interesting situation because after two rounds, two judges gave it to the in favor of uh, Darishev and one gave both rounds to Gudushaui. Interesting. That, that's what happens sometimes in a very close fight. We're definitely going to know who's the winner after this third round, if it goes the distance. Because right now the Georgian competitor is throwing really hard shots, trying uh, to knock his yeah, opponent you, you, out. You see now Georgian, Georgian fighter, he's really trying to, to turn this fight into a, <laughs> into a bloody war, yes. a stand-up battle, because that's his best chance to win. And we see now, now he's going, but... Yeah, and he, he defended from takedown yes. successfully, but now I think it's... Dar Darashov is always dangerous, you can <laughs> tell. Yeah, he is dangerous, and as we saw, you know, he is able to take his opponent down from any position, yes. in any situation. And now I'm not quite sure if, if uh, Gudu Shauri really needed this, this yeah. takedown. Yeah, it's, uh... we, we, we will see, yeah, he, he's trying to take the... Uh, really impressive side, side control, but, yes. but 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 you see, yeah, Darishov he feels comfortable in pretty much any position on the ground. Yeah, he he feels comfortable even being uh, in in the bottom position. And well, now, he's working his now way he's through al here, already, yes. Yeah, he's already working for the very dangerous for, for the arm bar. Very dangerous position. And you see, it's the third round. Be. They both are sweaty, and so it's not necessary that he will make it until the end. Even though you know, it's I, a very very good. Good position now for him. Very he's, good he's, position. He's, he's trying to. But there's no yeah. quit in this Georgian fighter. He he really is holding on to his arm for for dear life. Oh yeah, he he just got got out of very difficult position tonight. Positions, yeah, and I think I think he, he's, he's very he's, he's very gone. technical close of the legs there to close the triangle from Darishov. Oh yeah, controlling the situation here. And, and now Gudu Shauri, he is really trying to get out of this uh, submission. But you know, the, I think the time is working against him. Yeah, yes. because Darishov won one first two rounds on, on uh, two scorecards. So now, now Gudu Shauri is... It's a deep triangle, but... Yeah, but he's, he's, he's trying to like ground and pound his opponent. And because of that, like get, get out of the triangle. Oh, no. nice arm now, bar another, switch another switch to arm bar. Yeah, it's it's not easy in the third round. Well, this Georgian course, fighter but... really is strong. I'll tell you that he's holding on to defending these submissions using pure strength. Oh yeah, the yeah, posture you're... is good. Don't get me wrong. The posture is good. He's doing the right things, but the the positioning of the submissions. If it was anybody else with the lesser strength, this fight would be over yeah, by now. You can see that he's using a lot of like physical power to get out of it. Absolutely. Yeah. And now he finally got out of it, but it's already 10, 10 seconds left. Will he be able to do anything that that can change change the outcome of this fight? That was an outright war from beginning to end. Come on, Jody. 
Ladies and gentlemen, by a split decision, the winner is the blue corner. Well deserved victory there for Darishov. Hard fought fight. A split decision and another very, very close final. And now Azerbaijan already has two gold medalists.